Hi all, I am NCT. This is my third video. It is about how to uh, light LED by using Pic Microcontroller using assembly language programming. Uh, similar to that, I have already posted one video in the same channel which is about uh, LED blinking using Pic Microcontroller by Embedded C Programming. For that video, I give full demonstration and working model. But for this video, I show only simulation in Proteus. Uh, okay guys, let, come on, let's get into the video. Generally, this type of practices can do by Arduino and several types of microcontroller. But I choose microcontroller because the real-time implementation done only by the microcontroller. Uh, Arduino is a full developed board which is created for learning purpose about microcontroller and it was useful for, uh, pro, useful for uh, do prototype only. But in a real time implementation, we use only a microcontroller IC. Microcontroller IC has several types and different configurations. Based on the real time environment or specifications, the type of microcontroller and mode of configuration will be choose. Uh, all the real time functioning devices are working with a microcontroller IC. For example, mobile, computer, uh, ATM, alarm clock, etc. The microcontrollers can be programmed by using embedded C and assembly language. Uh, but industries are used only assembly language because uh, it occurs less space in uh, microcontroller memory. Um, so the efficiency of the microcontroller gets increased. The microcontroller can be programmed by using embedded C and assembly language. Uh, but industries are used only assembly language because uh, it occurs less space in uh, microcontroller memory. Um, so the efficiency of the microcontroller gets increased. Let's come on, let's see how to program in assembly language. First we need to know uh, in which port uh, we interface the LED in microcontroller the, then we need to check in your data sheet the port is in which bank I show in the screen the this database I cut the video first then we idle mm. uh, in this sheet uh, we check uh, four types of uh, banks see this bank 0, bank 1, bank 2, bank 3 then okay uh, check that once again hmm. okay check that uh, port C is in bank 0 and uh, try C try C is a register for port C to interface the port C we use a try C so bank C we need to start the bank, Z, uh, bank 0 and the bank 1 uh, to start the code, bank 0 and bank 1 uh, 0 0 means bank 0, 0 1 means bank 1 uh, by using this we start the bank we start the bank and uh, implement the port ok uh, I already done the programming uh, sorry guys I didn't tell Sorry guys, I can't uh, tell from the starting because of a uh, screen recording, uh, I can't type in this uh, tool. It is a uh, MPLAB X IDE. IDE means uh, Integrated Development, Development Environment. Uh, in that we program and um, by, by using IPE and PICIT3, we uh, dump the program into the microcontroller. First, we need to generate the code like that. Uh, well, I see show to you configuration bits uh, we set the I already told the configuration modes we set the configuration mode in this uh, sections this is a general configuration mode and generate source code uh, these lines are uh, generated and copy that and uh, insert into the code like that see the same lines I copy and paste in the line next we need to start a program R00 this one is uh, where to start we tell the microcontroller where you do start R00 means uh, 00 uh, it will store the program 
at zero uh, zero register where the zero zero memory is uh, placed. Then start select bank one. We 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 need to select a bank one. So BSF BCF uh, BSF is select first bit select first and BCF is a bit clear first. Uh, BSF uh, we we need to select a bank one. Set the RP not and RP one as RP not as a uh, one and RP one as zero zero one uh, that configuration. So BCF means clear the bit and then set as zero. BSF means select the bit so set as one. So zero one select the bit and uh, by the way we can select the bank one and uh, set port C as output. Uh, we need to set the output uh, port C as output. So all the bits each port has eight bit so all the bits as uh, by given zero value we can select the Put CS output and uh, we need to select a trace move WF. WF means a uh, word to F register. Uh, we select the trace here. Uh, by this way, we set the port C as output. Then bank zero. Uh, even though we can register the we can use a register uh, output and the input configurations are uh, made, but uh, for interfacing we can interface uh, we can use a port so we need to select a bank zero for bank zero both the bits can be zero rp not and rp1 value can be zero so i use bcf for both uh, rp not uh, rp1 uh, by this way we can set a value as zero zero uh, then bank zero will select that for turn on LED uh, by using the register by using the bit value I give one 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 uh, for four, three bits uh, by this way port C uh, in port C uh, go to start this loop will be continue and I give end by the, uh, by giving the end the programming loop will get end I compile that uh, and show you without error in okay one second okay guys the program was successfully compiled uh, then the x file stored in the occupy file directory and in proteus this is proteus uh, i already built the circuit for this practice Um, then uh, this is big microcontroller and uh, crystal device uh, is given this is big microcontroller and this is uh, uh, crystal device for oscillations uh, internal oscillations uh, made by this uh, device and uh, three leds i set the bit uh, last four bit as a uh, one zero one one like that uh, then likewise rc not as a uh, one led i interface uh, rc not with one led and rc2 and rc3 with uh, leds then that program create uh, one uh, x uh, x file in that likewise i uh, select this x file by this way i program this microcontroller in proteus uh, then run see the led will glow, glow. okay that's all guys Bye.